Hey everyone, my name is Wesley, and welcome back to episode 57, that's what I'm going with, 57 of my Red Dead Redemption 2 Let's Play series. Do I have game audio? Hello? Audio? Whoa! Oh, there was, so, <laughs> for those of you who don't know, there was a update the day before I recorded this. And I feel like it might have changed all my audio settings. Hey, I fixed the audio. <laughs> nice. Okay, for some reason, after the update, Windows Audio Mixer sets the audio to like zero. Now that that's out of the way, we have two missions. One with the captain of the idiots, Marker, and another with Reverend Swanson. And I think I'm just going to go right ahead and pick Reverend Swanson on that one. Yeah. Because screw Marker, am I right? But anyway, I'll catch up with you guys when we get there. As always, guys, whoa, whoa, whoa. As always, if you enjoy this episode, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I am planning on playing as much of this as possible and pre recording episodes before the release of Cyberpunk. But I do need to warn you that there is a chance that Red Dead might be put on hold because I'm going to be grinding cyberpunk so if you are okay with that i would appreciate if you could let me know in the comment section hopefully everyone's okay with it i'm sure all of you are excited to see cyberpunk and i'd really appreciate it if you guys could stick around and support the series reverend reverend swanson hello my belliger belligerently drunk friend <coughs> You okay, Mr. Morgan? Oh, it sounds sober. I don't know, Reverend. These are challenging times for all of us. Yes, mm -hmm. very challenging. You don't seem yourself. Coronavirus has so really I'm screwed all of us over. I've left the morphine, sir. Arthur, I'm in Reverend Swanson, would you excuse hey. us a minute? Dutch, what the hell, dude? I'm busy talking to my friend Reverend Swanson. New York. We are going to go to New York. Now, they have been chasing us south and east and west. We're going to get a boat. We're going to get on a river, and we're going to go north. New York. Can't and go grow mangoes in or this New York, bud. New Guinea, dancing girls, freedom. But first, we have to make a whole lot of smoke, a whole lot of commotion. And then we disappear. We need more commotion. One score and one whole hell of a lot of noise. We ain't so good at doing scores anymore, dude. No, but we are pretty good at making noise. Are you feeling all right, Arthur? Nope, I got sure, TB, but... Boy! Look at these guys rolling up on me. I brought a friend, Arthur. Hello, What's up, hello. friend of Eagle Fire? Flaz? Oh, it is Flash. Eagle Flaz. <laughs> His father is a great chief. He's got a haircut. Charles and I, we... Um, pretended to be mercenaries. Did me a great favor. Dutch Vanderlyn. How do you do? Not well, sir. Fine, thank you. Well, I am sorry to hear that. How's your father? Father is confused. Wisdom with weakness. His people, my people, we've suffered too much. Been lied to too much. Now they've taken our horses. Who? The infantry division posted at Fort Wallace. Oh, well, damn. No favors is a liar and a murderer. His people Dutch is going to use us as a smoke. Dead. Without horses, we cannot hunt. Without hunting, we will starve. This is another act of war. I see that. You men have helped me before, and I have money. Put your money away, son. Oh, there's well, still some Charles. good in him. You know, I told your father I will not fight over some horses. Jeez. But oh, Arthur, your eyes. No Get promise. some eye drops. Come along. Yeah. Okay, we, we lost them. Dutch again. Try to stop things from getting out of hand. I guess. Come along. Try to stop things from becoming Dutchy. We can get the more horses. I know. I understand Eagle Flies is angry, but I don't see how this will help anything. Especially not with Dutch whipping them up into a frenzy. Yep. We've got enough folks coming after us without adding army to the list. You going to let these bastards walk all over you? No. You're not. This is all that's wrong with this yep. world. Dutch definitely okay, has ultimatos. Oh, 
I mean, Altarium Motives. Alright. Let's head out. Why don't we try to take a hot air balloon, guys? I'm pretty good at that. Why am I paddling? Come on. Oh, that was quite a large fish. And the jump for us. Nice. Delightful. <laughs> we need to get that boat ashore. I think the best plan is to paddle up there silently, board her. And when we got control, we'll deal with that anchor, float away. All right, we'll I'll shoot everyone, and you guys shoot them to make sure they're dead. Whoa, there's no need to show off there. You got two guys rowing. It's just me on my own. Where am I mooring, guys? <laughs> How's that for boating terminology? Uh, um, sorry, I'm not very good at parallel parking. Okay. What is that guy doing? Oh, he's he's trying to help. Thank you. Oh, very kind of you. Okay. I'm thinking throwing knobs. What does everyone else think? No. There we go. Try not to kill anyone, Arthur. Oh, you just like shouted at me from like right there. Oh, 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 um. How? How are we going to do this? Um. Stealth knockout. There we go. Just had to put my throwing knife away. That, that was the same maneuver you used for killing, Arthur. What if I throw him overboard and <laughs> he drowns? Okay, yeah, that, was, that was dark. I'm gonna go smoke, alright? Oh! back in a bit. Okay. Huh. No, That's fine. Sleep. There's a dude, I think he's above us. Okay. How do I get there? Ladder? What the hell? Jeff, oh! Did they see me? I found a body. We have attackers on board. We'll take it back. What's ours? Why does that guy sound like I such a pansy? Ah! Okay, now that that was my bad. Hey yeah, hey yeah, hey yeah. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> that was like the ultimate ah! punch. <laughs> okay, well I didn't kill anyone. That <laughs> went so badly. <laughs> Um You think I have the first idea how this anchor Yeah. Works? Yeah. Just, Just blow, blow it up. <laughs> I don't, one of you guys can go back at some point and figure out how many lines are predicted in this. Why am I just on Arthur's ass cam over here? Yep, that that should do it. Uh oh. Hold on. Hold. Okay, not so bad. We good. That's how you break. I'll break the boat. I guess. Boys, all right back there? Yeah, I think so. But there's a huge hole in the boat. Uh oh. Oh, oh that is a big hole. Boys, get him out of here. Go on. Sea biscuit. <laughs> well, whatever else is wrong with it's you, quite the best pilot I've ever The horses are confused. Is it a ship's pilot or a I'll ship's captain? Can you go after the others? Yep. Okay. Come here, horsey. Get ya. Get back ya. Come on. Hiya. Over here. Come on. There you go. No, what the freaking hell? Arthur! Arthur, get back on the horse! Stop it! Stop it! Oh, are they just kind of like following me? That's very nice of them. No, no, they're not. Come here! Hey, now! 
Oh my gosh, Arthur, stop being an idiot. I don't know what I'm doing. Just everyone come this way. The worst seahorses ever. That is quite a wake that they've got going there though. Could surf that. Okay, we've nearly hit land. Why are there tire tracks? I did a thing, guys. Well, Arthur, w oh, Arthur needs to rest. What? I will. I like you, son. And after the horses, are we gonna wait for the army to come and wreak uh, its revenge? I missed something. Of course we ain't. Now let's go check out that fort of theirs. Is this a good idea? This is the I, only I feel like I completely missed something because my horse took so long. Purposes. Fighting the army ain't wise. Stop worrying. Oh, and Sadie told me about Cone. Meet us at Doyle's Tavern in San Denis when you can. Shall we go, son? Certainly. We'll what start the? some light reconnaissance oh, okay. out of Fort Wallace, and when Combs dealt with, you come meet us there. We'll set up a good spot for you. I don't know, Dutch. Yeah, well, I do. This is exactly the distraction that we need. Your father said that fighting was an impossible gamble. There's no winning for you in this. Father need not know anything. He'd rather live in ignorance. Come along, gentlemen. Your father would rather you did not do anything so foolish. Yep, I'm a Charles. I said I would stop this from happening. Would you talk to him? Big with rageful. Yes. Would you? Uh, sure, why not? Sure. Oh. I'll speak with him. You head on back to camp, check on the others, Dutch's behavior. It's weird. I, understand. I still would like to know what I missed out in that dialogue. It just like super cuts itself. I did, however, yeah. get a silver medal. What did I not get gold for? Round up the horses. Oh, well, geez. That wasn't my fault. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed that mission. That was quite weird. It didn't go to, according to plan at all. But if you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you all in the next video. Goodbye.